something that my pastor says all the time, and that is people don't care what you know until they know that you care. Mm -hmm. So I think the most important thing when it comes to addressing somebody who's dealing with a lifestyle of compla complaining all the time is getting that person to understand that you care about who they are, what they're going through, you understand that something might actually be worth complaining about. Mm -hmm. um, and in and, and getting close to them and understanding where they're at and having that true empathy for where they're at, then you can start trying to help behaviorally if, if they give you that position in their life. Proverbs 18, 21 says, death and life are the power of the tongue and those who love it will eat its fruit. So I think when you start having that relationship with somebody and you can say, hey, listen, we wanna follow the word of God. We, we want to live the lifestyle God's laid out for us. And in doing that, we get to enjoy God's benefits that are great and, and full. Uh, and so being able to address some scripture like Pastor Gina was talking about, like Pastor Wesley was talking about, different scripture that can help them to say, hey, this is way, the way God wants us to do it. And it might not be the way that you do it now, but if you can apply God's way to your life, you can see great change. Hmm. Show them you care and let your life be an example. Mm -hmm. If you can show them, hey, I'm, 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 I'm doing my best. I'm going through some stuff. But if they see even when you go through stuff that you have thanksgiving in it, that you're able to curve your words and take captive your thoughts. Okay, I'm ready to complain, but uh, am I supposed to do that? Mm. Taking that thought captive and saying, okay, this is the way I need to think about this. This is where I'm going to rejoice in all things. I'm going to step forth in the way that God's asked me to do. And in seeing you do it, it, it'll it'll cause questions. It'll cause somebody to say, hey, how is it that you get through it like this? So I think show them you care, give them scripture, and live the example. That's so good. Can yeah. I can I just go right back to something you were just saying mm -hmm. about life and death mm -hmm. being in the power of the tongue? You know, while you were talking, I was just thinking a quick way to just kind of catch yourself and, and even encourage the chronic complainers in your life is to just ask them, is what you're saying promoting life? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know? And I, I literally, while you were talking, I literally downloaded that into me. Yeah. Like, okay, Brandon, I everything that you're saying, is it promoting life? Yeah. And so that's just a quick and easy way to kind of catch yourself and the chronic complainers in your life. If you liked what you saw, make sure to like that video and comment below. Hit the subscribe button for more content uploaded weekly.